Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary and my expert analyst as always on these occasions is Stuart Robson. And all roads lead to this quarter-final here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Spain versus the Netherlands. Well, this has the makings of a very good game. Two sides full of quality, a great atmosphere and everything to play for. A last four places up for grabs here. Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And the contest begins. Tere Abeyera. Ona Batye. Well, good looking play with the ball of defeat. No worries for the keeper. Nicely timed tackle. chance and a goal it is no long wait for the opener today well here it is again the through ball is absolutely inch perfect and then what a strike that's hit with such ferocity certainly no stopping that that's a great goal Back underway, 1-0 it is. Alba Redondo. They've regained possession. Lika Martins. Well read to put an end to that attack. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. An attack full of promise. And she finds the back of the net. Right place, right time. And delivering for her team. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0.
could pull one back here. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal, mind you. It's a brilliant save. Who's going to get on the end of it? Struggling to get it away. Very quick thinking there. Superb block. And they need to get tighter here. A really intense pressure applied. And the keeper holding on to it. But really, she should have been doing better. The attack looks promising. Opportunity! Will it happen this time? And there it is! Another goal! And surely there's no way back from this now! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. But from a defensive point of view, it's not good enough. They stop marking in the box and don't close the scorer down. That's just poor defending. been one-sided but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going Pelova in the right place to cut out the pass well there it is as expected Spain have controlled most of the ball so far and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly their pressing has been excellent and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. And it wasn't a taxing save. Is it going to be? And begging to be put away. And in it goes. Well, she couldn't really miss from there, in fairness. Questionable defending, you've got to say. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. contest 4-0 oh she's in a really promising position spectacular save and she puts it away just what they wanted to see from her Well, I have to say, the keeper's done really well on the first shot, as you can see, but it's gone straight to an opponent and nothing she can do about the second strike. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Don Matti, Mariona, onto Puteas, and unable to keep possession. Moving forward effectively, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Mariona
determined defending Felica Martins and with that the attack fizzles out A concession of a corner here. <laughs> Playing it short. Oh, she's made a crucial tackle there. Pelova. Still trying to make something happen. And the cross comes to nothing. And that attack going up a dead end. And the keeper has the ball. That is that for the first half here. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Linette Bedenstein. Now with Grunen. And nicely struck. Well, here it is again, and just look at this. It's such good technique. It's a wonderful strike from that range. Goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Jenny. Mariona. Well, she's playing with a purpose. Ma Is this the moment? Oh, good work by the keeper. Now sending it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Nicely timed tackle. Oh, a nice looking pass. Badenstein. Great defending. Oh, and it goes. Another goal. And I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible. Well, here it is again, and really you have to question the goalkeeper. She shouldn't be beaten inside that near post, even if it was a good strike. Goal. Well, if you 
you enjoy high scoring contests this has been the game for you well that looked to me like excessive force what was the referee's reading of it and really Stuart they've left themselves with an awful lot to do in this one well they have they've got an uphill task now that was just ridiculous well they've decided to make a change comes to nothing in the end Linets Badenstein now here's Martins oh she's in a really promising position oh she's got them right back into this game down to 10 no matter real determination shown here well let's see this again the vision to play this through ball is superb. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. Goal. Well, you don't get too many score lines like this one. 4-4. Four, four. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Tremendous ball played through. And there it is, a chance. And it's a goal! Despite their numerical disadvantage, they find themselves in front. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But you have to question the keeper here. It's a good finish, but she shouldn't be beaten inside the near post. She'll be disappointed with that. Goal. Well, I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Ivana. And intercepted it. Jenny Bon Mati and with that the attack fizzles out this might be ideal for the counter it's a good looking ball in behind and the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out Bon Mati and Hermoso Alba Redondo a nicely cut out 20 minutes to go in this one oh that's a pass of high quality Badenstein and a goal to really bolster things for them two in front Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. lost intercepted and the pass could do damage and the keeper more than equal to the task so deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture Can someone get on the end of this? Might really be able to trouble them here. 
Well read to put an end to that attack. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And attempting the through ball. Mariona. And players waiting in the centre. Oh, a vital interception. Oh, that's a well-timed pass. Well, the fans want her to take on the shot. High echelon goalkeeping there. Now, how about the short corner? Could reduce the deficit. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. to play for a Spain throw-in and time for the change now Botellas and they produce the arrears you never know they still believe in themselves Well, as the replay shows, it takes a deflection. And as a result, the keeper had very little chance there. They just got a bit of luck. Five minutes to go. Well, strong play here. Roared. Teammates available. He's made a really important challenge. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, they profit from this situation. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Aitana Bonmati. Mariona. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Now, options are plenty. Firing is in. Can they put it away? The final whistle, and the Netherlands are through to the semi-finals. Well, they do deserve to go through to the next round because of their quality in attacking areas. But they must show greater desire to defend when they lose possession. Otherwise, they'll have problems in the next round.